Hey guys. Welcome to couple. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. The timing of the Justice Department's indictment of 12 Russian intelligence agents last week was very hard to believe, House Intelligence Committee Chairman Devin Nunes said on Hannity Wednesday. A federal grand jury on Friday indicted the agents for allegedly hacking emails from the Hillary Clinton campaign and Democratic Party during the 2016 election just days before Trump's one-on-one -on -one meeting with Russian President Vladimir Putin in Helsinki, Finland. The indictment also dropped shortly after House Republicans publicly questioned FBI agent Peter Strzok for the first time, and held a private meeting with former FBI lawyer Lisa Page. The hearing yielded several new revelations, including that Strzok felt significant regret for his numerous anti-Trump text messages and that Strzok maintained a top-secret security clearance, despite Attorney General Jeff Sessions earlier saying he believed Strzok's security credentials had been revoked. You might give them the benefit of the doubt, but why does this always happen? Noons, our California, asked. Every time something happens on one side where we find out a new revelation about what appears to be real problems in the FBI and DOJ with this investigation, all of a sudden, they drop an indictment. But FBI Director Christopher Wray said Wednesday night at a forum in Aspen, Colorado, I'm going to let the indictment speak for itself. He also defended special counsel Robert Mueller's investigation into alleged collusion between the Trump campaign and Russia, saying, I think it is a professional investigation conducted by a man I've known to be a straight shooter.